everyone and welcome to a Monday vlog, mail, mail Monday, unboxing Monday, milk toast Monday, I don't know. As you can see from the title, we are definitely going to be unboxing some stuff in this episode. Uh, a new mind chest came and a new Minecraft toy that I'd never seen before. I also want to say a huge thank you because all three of my episodes of Minecraft field trips reached 200,000 views. That was a kind of a goal for me and I hope that they continue to do well. Thank you guys for watching them. Them and go watch them again if you are wanting me to make more episodes. I am planning on it, but it also never hurts to show it some support. Um, okay, I want to go get milk toast. Paige and Molly are up at my cabin. I want to show you guys something because a lot of times I'll put down uh, a box and milk toast won't do anything. I want to show you what he can do when he's left to his own devices. So this is a piece of lighting equipment that I bought that I brought up here. I haven't unboxed it yet. And Milk Toast has done the honor. There's paper like all over there. I don't know if you can see it here. This is why I always say he is my unboxing partner because he loves nothing more in life than to shred boxes. Okay, let's go to the mail room. <laughs> <laughs> Hello boy. Okay, so the mail room's coming along. I just need to probably paint this wall a color. What color do you guys think we should paint it? Uh, I want to paint this a color, hang my map where I'm going to show where I get all of my mail from, and kind of decorate it a little bit more, but we got a new mine chest. So let's open this up, boy. Milk Toast is fascinated with the camera strap. Here you go. <laughs> There, you can have that, and you can play with that while I do the unboxing. Okay, so the addition I think is this arrow that has pierced the box, so we'll have to see what that means. <gasps> it's mossy cobblestone! <gasps> that makes me so happy! It's one of the blocks from the taiga, Milk Toast. You just don't care. <gasps> no, it's a jungle! Oh, so it's, um, I mean, Mossy Cobble is in the Mega Taiga, but this is referring to a jungle temple. The journey continues. Oh my, those creepers had me on the run for the past couple months. I've decided to travel farther to farther away places, so expect a chest from me every other month from now on. Oh, okay. Uh, as you know, behind every moss-covered temple lies ancient wisdom and an arrow to the face. I also made it to the hidden loot, but I was surprised once again. I found bound pages with the secrets of survivors, a real treasure, take a look. As I was crafting something special out of some indigenous melons and golden nuggets, an elusive ocelot kept staring at me. I wish I could have kept the little furball, but instead I convinced it to go live with you? What will you name your new ocelot pet? Oh my goodness, is it an actual ocelot stuffed animal? First of all, the t-shirt. Kind of reminds me of the Minecon uh, shirt from uh, the most recent Minecon. I think it's just a cool jungle temple shirt. So that's kind of cool. Um, okay, let's see what else we have. Oh my goodness, it is. I already have one of these. Um, oh my gosh, is it smaller? I have to do a size comparison. I'm kind of obsessed with him because he has a super derpy face, unlike my other one. Hold on. Here is my other one. Don't mind Milk Toast, he's just casually uh, peeking through some fan mail. Uh, okay, so this, I believe I got this at Minecon in London. And I think they're the same. They look to be about the same size. This one's tail might be, no, they look about the same. I have to say, I think this one's a little bit more like a normal ocelot in Minecraft. This one is, um, I mean, he's like his little derpy cousin. <laughs> oh my goodness, why are these so exciting to me? We got a watermelon pin. I love this. We also got the Minecraft Survivor's Book of Secrets. I think I have this actually. Uh, Microsoft sent it to me and I've seen it for sale at stores so this is actually this box was actually a pretty good value this month because you got the ocelot the book the pin the t-shirt and then you got an arrow sticker that you can put on something and then I'm assuming this stamp is the mossy cobble 
Actually, that wouldn't make a very good stamp though. Maybe it's an arrow. Okay, it is a mossy cobble block, but the stamp itself is an arrow. Ha <laughs> ha! I have got you guys down, mine chest. All right, so that is this month's mine chest, but I want to show you guys a toy that I have over there. So I saw this in Target and I was like, that's a strange toy. I have to get it and, and test it out with you guys because I'd never seen it before. All right, so this is called the Color Changing Potion Bottle. It says you can touch the bottle to brew potions, you can cycle through the different potions, find your inner brewmaster and start crafting your favorite potions from the game, turn on the bottle to prep it, then touch to brew. You'll get a different color potion each time you touch. Recipe not required. Uses two AAA batteries not included. Okay, hold on, I think I have batteries. I hope I have batteries. You guys. Look at how well stocked the mail room is. We've got triple A and double A. We just need the triple. Okay, this is all that was in the box. And I have to say, companies, do not use these little microscopic screws. I, luckily, this screwdriver, I had a bit that attaches to it. So I'm going to go pry this off and put the batteries in. Okay, I have turned it on. And it is this really cool cyan -y blue. I think I need to turn off uh, the lights. Okay, Milk, let's kill the lights. Kill that one. And that one, it's daytime, but this is still pretty cool looking. Ooh, look at it, Milk. Okay, so we're just supposed to tap it, I think. It turned green! And now tap it again. Did it change? Oh, it changed to orange. Yellow. Okay, so I'm just cycling through red. I mean... This toy is really kind of pointless, but it is cool if you are decorating like your room in a Minecraft theme. It's definitely like a high impact kind of a toy that is super cool. I mean, I feel like you could almost use this as a reading light. I think I like the teal the best. Okay, well this has been the jungle box and the uh, color changing potion toy. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time. Until then, Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.